Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Nathan. Just want to say good evening, everyone, with the East West Coast. Hope you guys enjoyed your day today here on Saturday. Hope you guys are also enjoying the weekend so far. And for this video tonight, of what I want to talk about is Doug Davidson, quote, hurt by being taken off contract after 40 years at YNR. So let's go ahead and do it. The link will be in the description down below. This is from SoulCentral.com, posted by Dan J. Kroll, the website for the 14th of September. 2018 post on Friday of uh, this week at the end of this week and it says Earlier this year Emmy winner Doug Davidson Paul Williams celebrated his 40th anniversary with Young Russell's That milestone made him the longest running YNR cast member Now according to the actor he might very well have filmed his final YNR scenes In a series of Q&A posts with fans Davidson revealed that he had been asked to go on recruiting status with YNR earlier this uh, earlier this year. At this time, at the time of his post, Davidson indicated that he had two more taped episodes that had yet to air. One of those aired on September 13th, meaning that fans may have just one more chance to see the actor. Davidson states that he has not been given any indication that he will tape any additional shows. Quote, It does hurt, to be honest, Davidson responded when a fan expressed their anger over his status change, adding that YNR has, quote, a new direction of late. General, uh, General Hospital alum and chart-topping singer Rick Springfield took to social media to express his surprise at Davidson's fate. Uh, Springfield said Davidson is his, quote, uh, best friend forever and was the best actor and mainstay character on the show. An Emmy-winning Emmy great human being. A truthful actor with an open heart. Another show needs to snap this giant heart, hearted brilliant actor up. Uh, this is from Rick Springfield's Twitter, uh, at Rick Springfield. Multisoft vet Stephen Nichols called Davison's downgrade, quote, an absolute travesty and called Davison, uh, quote, a man of, um, of utmost integrity. Uh, and this is from uh, his Twitter, at uh, Stephen Nichols, at Official Nichols. This is absolute travesty. What is going on over there? This man, this man has not only acted his, his ass off at hashtag one off for 40 years, but as a man of the utmost integrity, I'm saddened by the news. Much love, Doug. Davidson has understandably been moved by support from his colleagues. He has also received countless likes, retweets, and messages from fans. At last glance, there were several fan created petitions asking the show to rehire Davidson. As to whether or not Davidson would consider joining the soap, the actor stated that his, quote, history and loyalty is with YNR. Moreover, Davidson made it clear that he will turn to YNR in a heartbeat. Davidson joined YNR in May of 1978. In 2003, Davidson received his, received his very first Daytime Emmy nomination. A decade later, Davidson won his very first Emmy in the Outstanding Lead, Cat Lead Actor category. Officially, Davidson is said to be on recurring status. What is the reaction to Davidson being taken off contract? Do you think YNR will reconsider and have Paul appearing in more story? We will hear from you. There are many ways you can share your thoughts. I post a comment and article down below, sharing the article on Facebook, tweeting this article, or by submitting feedback. Uh, I have to say, you know, Doug Davidson is one, is one of my favorite actors of all time in soap opera history, and I do think that what's going on with right now, whether it's true or not, because it's not been um, confirmed by, you know, the higher-ups for YNR, for the, uh, the powers to be, uh, for YNR, CBS Daytime, and Sony too. But I just think that whatever is going on with Doug Davidson and his status on YNR, he should not be recurring at all. Period. Uh, you know, Doug Davidson is a legend. He is one of the actors that I look up to when it comes to soap operas and writing for soap operas, doing fan fiction of soap operas from time to time. And um, you know, I think YNR would not be the same without Doug Davidson. I mean, yes, you have Eric Braden, you have Melanie Thomas Scott, uh, you have. Um, Josh Romaro, you have Sharon Case, you have Peter Bergman, uh, Eileen Davison, but Doug Davison to me represents what YNR is all about, you know. And I can never forget, you know, the days when Doug Davison first came on to YNR as uh, as Paul, <clears throat> you know, as Paul Williams. I mean, he was, uh, you know, the son of a cop, and uh, you know, his mother Mary Williams was married to his father. I think uh, Carl Williams, I believe. Uh, I'm not sure. Tell me the comments below if I'm right or wrong with that. 
Um, but, you know, he was uh, the son of a policeman and the, you know, son of, of you know, a stay-at-home mom. And then, you know, later on down the years, he saw Paul, you know, as a, you know, private investigator. You know, he worked with many cases, got involved with many characters, such as, you know, Christine, um, Nina, uh, Michael Baldwin. Michael Baldwin was a bad guy. He got involved with Michael. Uh, even Longoria's character, Isabella. I mean, just so many memories. And, you know, just to see David, Doug Davison, you know, of where he's at right now, it's pretty disappointing and sad. I mean, I know that things are changing right now in the soap opera industry, but there has to be, uh, you know, there has to be some order going on in these soap operas, and they have to at least realize the history that, you know, actors like Doug Davison and Stephen Nichols uh, have done for, uh, I mean, they, of what they have for these shows, whether it's YNR, Days Are Lives, or so on and so forth, in my opinion. So I do hope that the situation for Doug Davison is cleared up and that he will be on YNR full time from here on out. But tell me, console guys, what you think about this? Do you like it? Do you not like it? Are you in the middle of neutral about Doug Davison, quote, um, quote, hurt, like being taken off a contract after four years of YNR? Um, but uh, tell me, console what you guys, think about this? Do you like it? Do you not like it? Are you in the middle of neutral about this? And uh, don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to always come on the channel, guys. And until next time, is Nate Sam. Peace. Take care. I will see you guys later for the next video coming up uh, tomorrow morning or in coming minutes. So stay tuned. So until next time, take care, guys. I'll see you guys later. I will see you guys for the next video coming up right now. Stay tuned. I will see you guys later. Bye.